Do you want to know how to rank higher in Google Maps with GMB posts? Sit tight, I'm going to show you an easy yet highly effective strategy to rank Google My Business listings fast. Not subscribed to my channel yet? No problem, hit the red subscribe button now. My team and I have spent thousands of hours testing and analyzing different things to determine what works and what doesn't. Today you will learn what GMB posts are and why you must take advantage of them. GMB posts are important for three reasons. One, you will rank for more keywords. Two, you will get more exposure. Three, you will push more authority towards your money sites and YouTube videos. I will now show you how to create GMB posts on autopilot using our brand new content catalyst software and I will give you free access to this tool today. In case you don't know what a GMB post is, a GMB post is a Google My Business post that helps you to keep your listings updated and it's also a great way for you to introduce new content to your GMB listing, helping you to optimize for all kinds of different keywords. As you can see here, I'm logged into my Google My Business listing and to the very left we have our menu and if you go to info you're going to be able to see all the information associated with your listings and if you go to posts you're going to be able to create your first post. Now let me introduce you to Content Catalyst. This is a brand new tool that we just created to help you guys scrape for content that you can use on your GMB listings. This tool has pretty much two features. And feature number one is to create and scrape for content and then we're going to have the option to use that content and turn it into videos and videos are a great way to get additional link juice to your GMB listings. What we want to do here is we want to type in our main keywords, could be one, could be more keywords and we're also going to add a call to action which will be appended to the end of each post. Once the tool has finished scraping for content, you will see this pop-up notification telling you that the scraping has indeed finished. Click OK. Now that we have scraped 10 posts, the next thing that we want to do is we want to open up each file and we want to make sure that there are no spelling mistakes and we actually want to make sure that the content is readable because we have to understand that our posts will be seen by people, by real people, and it's important that the posts are of high quality. As you can see here, it says, how much does a deck cost? I'm going to get rid of this because we don't really need this. And then the answer is, the cost of a professionally built pressured treated wood deck starts at about $15 per square foot, including materials. The cost for an elaborately built deck using costly hardwoods or composite materials can run about $35 per square foot. And as you can see here, our call to action has been appended to the end of the post. Now this post is definitely all right. So what I would do next is I would want to open up all these posts and I want to make sure that they're okay. This is one way for you to use a tool. And again, this is going to be free. You can actually grab this tool right now by clicking on the link below this video. This is completely free. And we created this tool for you guys because we want to save you time and money. So this is one way, right? The second way would be for you to describe your services because if a person finds your GMB profile, what's the first thing that they're going to look at? They're going to look at your reviews. They're going to look at, okay, whether this person, this company has posted any content or not because if you post content to your listings regularly, it tells the visitor that you actually engage with your clients, that you care about your clients. And that's really important for creating a positive image. So you want to open up all of these posts and you want to make sure that they're okay. Now that we have checked all of our posts, the next thing that we could do is we could use the content and we could create videos using the content that we just scraped. Now, how does that work? In order to do this, you need an account and it's got to be a paid account. You can actually get a free trial on Content Samurai. I think they have a seven day or 14 day free trial. So you actually don't have to spend any money up front and you're going to plug in your email address and password. And you're going to be able to choose the content folder. This is the folder where all of our posts are located at. 
and then you're going to put this and you're also going to choose the Chrome, the Chrome download folder. And then you're going to click on create videos. Now the create videos feature, this step will take time because it has to log into Content Samurai and it has to upload the content individually and then wait until Content Samurai has produced the videos. This is a step that I will not be performing right now simply because of the amount of time involved to use the content to create videos with it. The next thing that we want to do is create a post. So log into your GMB account in your Gmail account and you want to go to business.google.com forward slash manage in case you have multiple GMBs in the same Gmail account, just click on the GMB that you want to manage and then you click on posts and then click on this here, which enables you to create a new post. As we can see here, we have the ability to add content to our GMB and in case you want to add photos, which I highly recommend by the way, um, you can do that. Just click on this icon and add photos. Now what's important is that the photos that you add, they're actual real photos associated with your GMB listing or that you use something like royalty free images. That is fine as well. Now what we want to do next is we want to grab the content that we created. So I'm going to do this now. I'm going to copy the question and the answer. And I go back here and I paste it in like this. All right, so I have forgotten to add the CTA in here, which I've done now. Call us now and then I mentioned the phone number. And as you can see here for the button, I added the learn more button. And then I added the free dot site domain that I previously created thanks to the help of Google. And now what we want to do is you can click on preview. And voila, here's our post. Here we also have the learn more button and that's great. And if you want to go ahead and publish the post, you can do that right now. So click publish and our first post has been published. Now what's important to notice here is how many times are you going to be posting to your listings? And I advise you to post a minimum of three to four times a week, simply because it tells Google that your GMB listing is active. And the more you post, the, the more eyeballs you attract to your listings, the better it's going to be for your search engine rankings. And you're also going to be getting more engagement and hopefully also website clicks and phone calls. So this is what we want to achieve with this specific strategy. So I advise everyone to do this. I mean, if you're serious about ranking your GMB listings, then this is a must strategy for you simply because again, it is free and you can do it in just a few minutes a day. So it's a great addition to whatever you're doing right now. In case you want to get access to this tool, again, it's completely free. So just click on the link below this video now to get immediate access to this tool. I hope you enjoyed this video. In case you are not subscribed to my channel yet, hit the red subscribe button right underneath this video now to be notified when I publish a new video on the latest cutting edge digital marketing strategies. Thank you for watching.